Could this be the most extreme school run in the world? The rapidly flowing waters of Nepal's Trishuli River might be well known to adventure sports enthusiasts, but these residents of the Benegat district take their lives in their hands often several times a day using hand-operated cable crossings to reach the other side. There are almost a dozen of these crossings in the area and many more throughout Nepal which villagers use to reach shops, visit relatives and friends or simply to go to school. There are few permanent bridges on the river and they are many miles apart forcing the locals to use these more direct if less safe routes. In recent years Accidents have increased demand for footbridges to be built in the area. In 2010, five people died, falling into the water when a cable snapped, and many others have suffered injuries, including losing fingers. Recently, Nepal's Prime Minister, KP Oli, announced a plan to replace the cable crossings with 366 suspension bridges over the next two years. And in January 2016, the first of these bridges, connecting the villages of Mantali and Gimdi over the Bagmati River, was opened. As the rest of the bridges are built, it could mean the end for the cable crossings. But for now, they remain the only direct route for thousands of people living in remote areas. <laughs>